If you're new to e-signing, it may seem a little daunting at first, but it's really quite a simple process. First, you'll receive an email like this requesting you to e-sign a document. Open the email and then click on this link, which tells you to review and sign the document. Take a little time to review the agreement and when you're ready to sign, click on the yellow start tag. This will take you to the first field that needs your attention. So here we need to click once in the box, as instructed, to sign the document. So let's take a look at our options for adding a signature. You can use either a font-based signature or a biometric signature. Either way, first you should type your name in this box here, and this will generate a font-based signature. So if you want to use this in your agreement, go ahead and click Apply. If, however, you prefer to use the biometric option, where you actually draw your signature with a mouse, then click on this icon and, using your mouse, draw your signature carefully. If you make a mistake and you want to redraw your signature, then click Clear and start over. When you have a signature that you're happy with, click Apply. Now your document has been signed, and you can also see that the signer's name has automatically populated here and also up here. The system will guide you through any more fields that you may have to sign and once it recognizes that you've completed all the necessary fields, this button appears and you can click it to complete the signing process. Now, there are a number of ways you can view or retrieve a copy of the signed agreement. You can immediately download a copy by clicking this button and then you can save it to your computer for future reference if you want. And since a copy of the agreement has been sent to all parties, you'll receive an email in your inbox and attached to that email is a signed copy of the agreement.